So curious about everything. He's walking around, just smelling. He's never been out of, off the farm. Oh no! Stop! Stop! No! No, don't do that. Come here. Come here. It's Lester here. It's our first vet visit. And I'm telling you, they need a waiting room for goats. Here's about everything. It's walking around, just smelling. He's never been out of, off the farm. Oh no! No, things just went from bad to worse. Stop! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Oh shit! Oh no! Huh? <laughs> So I have to be honest, I need you to look at your calendar there behind you. And I want to apologize. <laughs> I just could not leave here with the conscience and, and let you know that that was uh, something that someone else had done because that would be Mr. Huck, okay? And if that's not bad enough, I'm gonna show you the, uh, the blinds here. And so all of the uh, evidence I was gonna hide in my pocket and I just thought, you know what? I just need to apologize and uh, and see what the uh, consequences of Mr. Huck's going to be here. And now he's about to get the he's about to get the pocket. So I heard like banging around on the door, but I didn't actually know that that's what he was doing. I thought he was no, going up there. He was like, he, you know, he was headbutting the door. He yeah. was nibbling on your um, the on the knob. Doing? Man, he I tell you what, y'all need a goat waiting room just for for kids, literally kid yeah. K I D D S for kids only. Right. Because it needs to be goat proofed. So sorry about your blinds and your calendar there and the knobs and everything else. Yeah, <laughs> hey, at least he didn't poop. At least he hasn't pooped. That, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. that's shocking. Today. All right, so for the kids that are watching, you know I did the right thing after all. Right thing. Because I actually videoed all of the destruction and I wondered what I should do. So I just hit it all in my pocket and thought I would never care. But I did the right thing. 